Hello, good morning everybody. The agenda for today for second grade is going to be a number one welcome, number two the reflection, number three we are going to watch a video about cooperative learning and this is going to be the emotional content, number four singing a song and a special, number five time to read and a secret, we are going to continue with our reading, uh, number six contents that are going to be Milton and receipts and we are going to learn how to prepare food. Uh, we are going to learn how to prepare basic food. Number seven practice book and at the end we are going to have question and answer. Let's start. The reflection for today, it says, never stop learning because life never stop teaching. Every time you have a new experience, you have to learn because this is going to help you to live your life. Everything that we are doing, this is going to help us to live better. It's not only academic things, we have to learn a lot. We have to learn how to live with others. And for this, we are going to watch a video about cooperative learning. On, the, on our planet, on our world, it is not possible that we have to change with different kind of people. All we are humans and we have to help us. For that reason, I want to you check this video, watch this video, and you are going to learn um, a new experience about this video. After we watch the video, the bridge, and we have to learn a message that we have to be cooperative with all kind of people because we are humans. It is necessary to you not differences between our people. Remember that the differences help us to understand better 
in, in how humans are. You have to respect the belief, the culture, etc. For that reason, we are gonna see the sun and spatial. Remember that we are using the reading patch. This is the reading patch, the blue one. It says reading patch, page 102. Take up your reading patch and open on this page. We have been uh, singing these songs by three weeks. This is the third week that we are we are singing. Please, uh, I want you to practice. Let's listen the song and let's sing. Remember that the song is gonna help us to pronounce better our language. Let's listen. is the same from the video because it talks that we are special remember that the raccoon the mapache and the rabbit help each other because the other animals didn't want to get permission for that reason we have to say that oh we are special and we have to help us well we are going to continue with our reading parts i will tell you we are going to continue with anna's secret Anna's secret reading. We were we were reading the last class, and we are gonna um well we are gonna have a warm up about the vocabulary. Remember, coach, fruit, player, soccer, and team. And it's the time to read pages. And I told you before, we are going to read pages 44, 45, and 46. But we are going to read uh, 41, 42, and 43. We already read the last class, but it's unnecessary uh, to do it again because we are going to um, remember the story. Well, let's listen. My older sister, Isabel, is great at sports. She's a wonderful soccer player. In the afternoons, she plays on a soccer team with some other girls. I want to play on Isabel's team, so I practice hard every day with my dad. He teaches me how to kick the ball. He shows me how to pass it. We don't tell Isabel, but I'm practicing. We keep it a secret. You should practice hard every day, dad says. You should eat lots of fruit and vegetables, and don't eat too much candy. So I follow his rules. One day, one day Isabel comes home from soccer practice. She's worried about the next game. Our best player can't come, Isabel tells Dad. What are we going to do? This is my big chance. The next day, I go to the practice before the game. Can I play? I ask the coach. Do you know how to play? She asks. She looks a little surprised. The coach hands me a red shirt. Practice during the warm-up, she says. You'll play on the red team, Anna. Isabel will play on the blue team. Well. This is the final page from uh, well, the final reading from page 46. There are missing 47, 48, 49. The next class we are gonna finish this reading. I want to ask you, and it's time to check out our reading comprehension. 
what we have here, page 44, page 44, what is going to be the equation? The equation is going to be very simple. Uh, listen my question and you will type on the chat. Remember, type on the chat the right answer. What is Isabel's problem? What is Isabel's problem? What is Isabel's problem? Well, I am checking that much of you are typing. Very good. What is Isabel's problem? Ah, that the best player of her team is not gonna come. Very good. They have a problem because the best you know, player is not gonna come on the next match. Page 45. Page 45. Well, on page 45, as you can see on the picture, Anna is asking to the coach. Uh, but what is the equation that Anna asked to the coach? What is the equation that Anna asked to the coach? What is the equation that Anna asked to the coach? Very good, I see the equation. Can I play? Can I play? She asked to the coach because she wanted to play with her sister. Very good, very good. Uh, can I play? And what the coach says, do you know how to play? She asked. She looks a lot of surprises. And the last equation from reading comprehension, page 46. Um, what is going to be? The team, the Anna's team. What color is going to be the Anna's team? Sorry. What color is going to be the Anna's team? What color is going to be the Anna's team? No, it's not going to be blue one. Isabel's team is going to be blue one. Anna's team is going to be red one. Well, very good. Remember that we are checking, we are doing this because this book is helping us to understand better how to read the reading comprehension for that reason's reading parts. And the next class we are going to continue, we are going to continue the, the, um, the final pages and we are going to answer the exercises from our unit. Thank you so much and we are going to start because I have a surprise for you. We are going to start our student book class. I will give you a chance to you take up your student book. Well everybody, we are going to start with a summarizing class. I need to you understand better what was the content for the last class. The last you know, class we were talking about Look at, look at here, the healthy eating plate, and we were talking about kind of food, fruits, vegetables, milk and dairy, fats and oats, meat, fish and eggs, and grains. What are we going to do? You are going to help me to understand better what kind of food is going to be the food I have here. For example, the banana, the banana is going to be for the family for type, type in your, in your, in, in your chat. The banana is going to be for, excellent, for fruits. I see that much of you, much of you are typing the correct answer. Look at here, what is this, what this? It's a, excellent, it's a tomato. On which family member is going to be? On grains, vegetables, or fruits. Excellent. I see that much of you says on vegetable. I got meal here. Much of you ask, we cannot drink meal, but it's a delicious beverage. The meal is gonna be on milk and dairy. Very good. And very um, important to say that milk and dairy is leche y derivado, for example, the cheese, the cream, etc. And what color is going to be the meal? It's not going to be white because it doesn't appear that it's white. It's going to be pink color. Very good. Remember that we are checking, we are checking this healthy eating plate. And what about this? They are eggs. 
What color, or listen to my question, what color are going to be related with the healthy eating play this dog's eggs? This eggs. What color are going to be? Very good. Much of you says yellow or a kind of green. And finally, finally, oh, sorry, I got here, this one. Oh, sorry. We are gonna, we are gonna hide this. No, it's okay. No le vamos a hacer publicidad. This is a noil. A noil. What color is gonna be related with the healthier in play? It's gonna be blue one or orange? Much of you are typing, much of you are typing the correct answer. Thank you very much. And finally, what color is gonna be this one? Very good. It's gonna be with meat, fish, and eggs. It's a kind of green or orange. And finally, what is gonna be this one? It's a bread. Bread. And which color? Blue one. Very good because it's about grains. Grains of family. Well, this was the class. This is the summarizing. Remember that you can play up your home checking your toys. And what family member are gonna be and what color is gonna be related with healthy and in play. Thank you so much. Well, after we have our summarizing about our healthy eating play, uh, we are gonna continue and we have what we have here we have uh, the receipt and it says label read the receipt and number and here we have the name this is a project we are gonna do it at the end of class uh, we show you how to make a uh, fruit salad but with different kind of fruit uh, but here we have apples balls strawberry knife uh, peaches and grapes what are apples these are apples on this case we are gonna write here apples bow strawberries knife peaches and grapes and we are gonna follow we are gonna follow the receipts the step number one is wash your hands Psst, wash your hand number two watch the fruit wash the fruit number three cut the fruit with a knife number four mix the fruit in a bowl remember that you have to take care with the knife and number five serve and eat this is a very simple receipt we are gonna learn how to do it on the final class well and what we have here we have picky pity picky pity it's a point and we have to attach the sticker from 3c it says picky pity doesn't like Lights, yes. Doesn't like light, uh, lights, yes. Picky pity doesn't like fish or peach. Well, he doesn't like milk or yogurt and or cheese. Yogurt or cheese. He doesn't like hamburgers. He doesn't like hamburgers or uh, potatoes. He doesn't like lettuce and tomatoes so what does what does picky pity like what food does he eat he loves he likes brownies and ice cream and anything sweet look at this picky pity i don't know if he's healthy because he likes only two kind of uh, food brownies and ice cream brownies and ice cream doesn't like fish peas meal yogurt cheese hamburgers potatoes lettuce or tomatoes and at the end what are we gonna do in our student book look and circle t through or f false joe is the boy sue is the girl yeah, the sad face is doesn't lie. The happy face lies. Look at this. He likes beats. Remember that he is used for boys. He likes beats. Look at the beats. Excellent. It's a happy face. It's 
True. Number two. Help me on the chat. Me ayudan en el chat, chicos y chicas. Number two. She, she, she likes cheese. She likes cheese. Sue and cheese. Yes, she does or no, she doesn't. Yes, she does or no, she doesn't. Hey, I see that much of you are typing here the correct answer. Number three, both. He and she, they. They don't like bitch. Uh, they don't like bitch. Yes, they do. No, they don't. Look at here. False. It's false. It's false. You can tell me they are true or false. Or yes, they do. Or no, they don't. Number four. They both. Both. They like ham. Look at the faces. Happy faces. is true. Number five. Please type the, the answer. Chi, chi, su, su doesn't like mio. Su doesn't like mio. Very good. Much of you are typing the correct answer. You say that su doesn't like mio. It's true. True. Yeah, she doesn't like mio. In number six, he, in this case, yo, doesn't like bananas. He doesn't like bananas? True, he doesn't like bananas. Very good. And which pages are we going to work on practice book? Las páginas del practice book are going to be 36 and 37. 36 and 37. I'm here on practice book. Those pages, these pages we already finished. Now it's time to check it out if you understand the steps to make a fruit salad. First of all, what are we gonna do? Wash, wash your hands. Look and match. Wash your hands. Number two, what I'm gonna do? Wash the fruit watch the fruit number three number three cut the pieces cut the pieces and finally mix the fruit mix the fruit knife and scramble the words try to do it Try to do it only with the pronunciation that I will say. Knife. Knife. Strawberries. Strawberries. Ball. Ball. Here, and the number two, and the number two, I have to tell you that because it's plural, I says strawberries. If it is singular, I will say strawberry. And it ends only with the letter Y. On this K, because it's a plural, I will change the letter Y. I will add I-E-S. In other words, in Spanish, because I want to you learn and, and understand. En el número dos, chicos y chicas, Stradberry, con Y al final, es solamente para una fresa. Aquí hay tres, entonces se utiliza plural. No les va a salir si ustedes solamente la ordenan como singular. Tiene que ser Stradberries. Y le cambiamos la Y por I latina y le agregamos ES, fresas, ¿verdad? Es igual que en español fresa, le agregamos fresas, una S para el plural. Well, in the last page that we have to develop, it's about Pikipiri. But on this case, it's gonna be a picture. What do you think? You are gonna, you are gonna answer on the chat. You can help me. What is gonna be the right answer? Look at the picture. He likes peace or he doesn't like peace. What is gonna be the correct answer for you? 
Very good. He doesn't like peas. Circle. Circle in your practice book. He doesn't like peas. Peas are guisantes. Number two. Number two. Look at the face. He's happy or sad. He likes ice cream or he doesn't like ice cream. Time. The correct answer. Very good. Excellent. He likes ice cream. Number three, look at the face. He likes brownies or he doesn't like brownies. He likes brownies. And number four, he likes lessies or he doesn't like lessies. He has lessies. He doesn't lie. And here we have to, at the final exercise, we have to recognize if it is he or they. They is for plural, he is for only a boy. He, on this case, he, circle he, he doesn't like. Type, type, type. What is the answer? Corn. Very good. I see that much of you already understand. And they like, they like bits, bits, bits. Much of you are asking me, what is the meaning of bits? On this case, it's going to be remolacha. A very delicious kind of vegetable. Well, this was the class. I will show you a video how to prepare a fruit salad. Let's continue. What I have here, the, the, the surprise that I have, we are going to follow the recipe for how to make a fruit salad. It says that we have to use strawberries, apples, grapes, peaches, you know, and um, grapes, apples, strawberries, well, this kind of fruit, the bowl and the knife. North. But I don't have this kind of fruit. I only have apples, I have an orange, and this is gonna be the ingredients. Orange, uh, sorry, orange, apple, I have a yogurt, I have the bowl, the little bowl, and I have the knife, and I have a little spoon here. But what is going to be the first step? Remember, we are going to follow the step. It says that the first step is wash your, wash your hands. Look at my hands. What I'm going to do? I will put water, salt. I will move this. I already washed it. After the second step is going to be wash the fruit. Wash the fruit. I will wash the fruit here. I have to wash it very well. I have to wash it very well. The third step, and be careful with the knife. Okay? You have to do it with your parents. It's going to be cut the fruit with the knife. You have to take care because you can damage with your knife. In this case I will cut, cut the orange, cut the apple. You have to cut it carefully. You can do whatever shape you have. I already cut. I put in the bowl. This is the bowl. And I have to mix with a spoon. But before to mix, what are we gonna do? I will put a yogurt because I like yogurt. Look at this delicious fruit. And after, finally, you will mix, you will mix, mix, and serve and eat. That's all. Do it at your home.